Question number 10, David Bennett. Mr Speaker, uh, my question is to the Minister of Transport. What work is the government doing to make New Zealand roads safer? The Honourable Stephen Joyce. Uh, Mr Speaker. Um, Speaker, today I launched the Safer Journeys discussion document containing a range of possible government initiatives that could help to improve road safety. Safer Journeys invites views on a number of priority road safety areas, including alcohol and drug-impaired driving, safer speeds, young drivers, motorcycling, roads and roadsides. The feedback received from road users will be used to develop a national road safety strategy for the next 10 years. Initial actions will be implemented over the next year or two, and I stress public acceptability is an important aspect of changes. David Bennett. Supplementary question to the Minister of Transport. What else is the government currently doing to improve road safety? The Honourable Stephen Joyce. Uh, Mr Speaker, last week I announced that from 1 November this year it will be against the road rules for drivers to text or talk on a handheld cell phone while driving. This is aimed at combating a specific driver distraction which has grown to become a significant problem. Between 2003 and 2008, there were 482 injury crashes and 25 fatal crashes in New Zealand where the use of a mobile phone or other telecommunications device was identified as a contributing factor. Drivers will still be able to use hands-free cell phones and make 1-1 calls for genuine emergencies as well. The Honourable Darren Hughes. Mr Speaker, when he set a fine of $80 for talking uh, on a cell phone, did he take into account the fact that for nearly 20 years drivers have been allowed to talk and drive? And if so, why did he set the fine so high when it comes in in just a few weeks' time, rather than allowing drivers to get used to the change with a lower fine and warnings? The Honourable Stephen Choice. Order. Mr. Speaker. Order. Due consideration. Mr. Speaker. Order. I don't know what provoked that outburst from the back of the House, but uh, I think we should actually hear the Minister's answer before there's all that massive interjection. With the Honourable Stephen Joyce. Uh, Mr. Speaker, due consideration was given to the appropriate level of fine and demerit points, and it is equivalent to the uh, exceeding the speed limit by 11 to 15 kilometres an hour. David Bennett. Supplementary question to the Minister of Transport. What other initiatives is he aware of to improve road safety? The Honourable Stephen uh, Joyce. Mr. Speaker, I have seen a proposal from one former member of this House who is concerned about the use of retreads once they are past their use by date. He seems to think it's a particular issue in and around the parliamentary complex, resulting in some erratic steering. Now, it's not an issue that's expressly raised in the road safety strategy, but I'm advised the Minister is prepared to accept submissions from any members, particularly those from the opposition benches, who are concerned about the overuse of retreads once they are past their use-by date.